Hi, I'm John with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to be showing you how to repair your appliance. We're going to show you how to install a new door hinge bearing for your Frigidaire refrigerator. It's a really easy job that only requires a flat blade screwdriver, a Phillips head screwdriver, a 3 8 inch nut driver, and a few minutes of your time. When you open the package, you'll get one new door hinge bearing. The reason why you'd be replacing the door hinge bearing is if the doors are difficult to open or close, if there's a popping sound when opening and closing the doors, or if the doors don't seal. The part we'll be replacing is located at the very bottom edge of the freezer door. To access the part, we're going to need to remove the refrigerator door, which entails removing this top hinge assembly. We'll first need to remove this protective cover. So use a Phillips head screwdriver to loosen and remove the screw that holds the cover in place. Use a 3 8 inch nut driver to loosen and remove the two screws that hold the hinge assembly in place. Then lift up to release the hinge from the door and then remove it. With the top hinge removed, we can now take off the refrigerator door. To do so, we're going to pull the top edge out slightly Then, as we lift it up, it's going to release from the bottom hinge. Then remove the door. With the door removed, we can now access the door hinge bearing. We're going to need to set the outside edge down on the ground, so we put down a moving blanket to prevent any scratches. Then on the bottom of the door is the door hinge bearing. Use a small flat blade screwdriver to pry out the old door hinge bearing. There's a little slot there you can put it in. If we turn the screwdriver sideways, we'll slowly pull out the bearing. Here's the old door hinge bearing next to the new one. If you already have the new part, great. If not, you can get it from AppliancePartsPros.com. Position the new door hinge bearing so that its edges line up with this triangular opening in the bottom of the door. Then press it into place. With the new hinge in place, you can now reinstall the door. When you install the door, start by putting the lower hinge in position first. Then tilt back the door and you'll need to align it. And now you can reinstall the top hinge, putting it in place and then thread in and tighten the two retaining screws. Reinstall the protective cover and then thread in and tighten the retaining screw. And you're done. Thanks for joining us for another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. And be sure to check out our other repair videos on our website, on our Facebook page, and on our YouTube channel.